What's up guys? So we finally made it back from our fishing trip and I told you guys I was going to post a video of filleting the fish and cooking it. I got my own little way of doing it. People have all different kinds of ways but you know the way I do it I kind of like it so let's get started. Okay guys so step number one uh, we got to fillet the fish and you need a really you know you need a decent fillet knife. I purchased this one in Walmart it was like 15 bucks. Um, it does the job. It's pretty sharp. <clears throat> I like it. You know, nothing crazy expensive. People buy really expensive knives. Yeah, I mean, I'm sure those expensive knives are, knives are nice and stuff, but this one seems to do the job for me. Um, so what I like to do is you start off right here and you cut down. Cut down right behind that gill. An angle a little bit right there and once you get down huh, fish is still alive once you get down there you want to go down right here you kind of zip it right down you're gonna hear all those bones you should hear all those bones while you're going down with the fillet knife and be careful because these knives are extremely sharp just get this guy straightened out once you hear all that, once you get right past the section of bones, right there, you can make an incision going right down. And then once you go down right behind where the rib cage is, the rib cage ends right about here, you take your fillet knife and you just slide it right down. That's step number one. Once that is done, I like to keep this fillet on and then I flip it on this side just to keep the balance of the fish and I go do the same process on this side. Cage completely intact. And now you take your knife and you work from the back of the tail. And you just work your, your knife right down to the front of the fillet. Now you're left with a fillet, clean fillet, put that to the side. Now you have your second fillet right here. So that is the process to do these. And you want to wash these off obviously. Once you get these washed off, you're ready to cook them. Alright guys, so after step number one, we're on to step number two, which is seasoning the fillets. After you fillet them, this is what they should look like. And what you're going to do is you're going to put these fillets in the flour first, then you're going to dip them in the eggs, then you're going to dip them in the Italian style breadcrumbs. And these are exactly what I use. The Italian style breadcrumbs, they are already seasoned. Uh, salt, actually first thing is salt, salt them. and also, I use some a little bit of Old Bay. I love Old Bay. Uh, some people might not like it. It's a little bit of a spice. So, and then when you cook them, you just use just regular canola oil. Nothing special. So let's get started. So first things first, we're gonna salt these. Batter, or the flour rather. Drain it 
right, drench it right in the yolk so that the breadcrumbs can obviously stick to the yolk. There's one. So I got my oil poured in. I'm gonna fire up this oven. Oven. And we wanna get it like between mid and high, so as long as it heats up. And you have them sit there for a couple minutes. Fish is really quick. So we're gonna wait it out a couple minutes here. All right guys, so when all said and done, it's supposed to look like this, coming out of the frying pan. Nice golden brown, ready to eat. This will serve about, you know, one person. So, perfect, it's all done. If you guys like this video, please like, and subscribe we'll be posting more videos of ice fishing uh, probably coming up this weekend so stay tuned and thanks again for watching thanks